Hey Hi. folks. <laughs> hey folks. <laughs> so this is our 2017 wish list. Books in this in this list which I've been wishing to read since 2010. But okay, so number one, mine. Okay, so this book is not that I've been meaning to read since 2010, but since 2013, precisely 2014, precisely. Yeah. Because in my first year, it negates the purpose of precisely, <laughs> precisely but I'm not sure. Yeah. So it, it all began in the first semester of my first year in college. The great epic Homer's Odyssey. So the books Iliad, Iliad, Iliad and Odyssey by Homer are in my to read list since then. And I couldn't, I just I tried to read Odyssey, I just couldn't. Maybe it was in the right time, you know, and they're classics. If you don't know, Homer's Iliad and Odyssey are actually the first literary text ever written. How cool is that? So I really hope I read it this year. My next, no, my first. This Modern Love by Will. Will Dabishar? Will Dabishar? I don't know how he pronounces his surname. Okay. Uh, you know what that book is about? All the love stories or heartbreaks and everything has been compiled in one book. People around the world sent him letters and mails. That's, and that's that sounds how he, very romantic and yeah, And he decided how. Why do you want to be? I don't know, I just do. I just want to know what people. Yeah. What their. Okay, yeah, yeah, nice. So, my number two, the book I want to read this year is Franz Kafka. Franz Kafka is not the book, Franz Kafka is the author, and I want to read Franz Kafka's Metamorphosis and Ooh. The Trial. Ooh. Okay, so Mole was the first one who told me about Franz Kafka, about Metamorphosis, how this guy turns into a beetle. But then I saw the TED video on dystopia, and uh, that's when I fell in love with the term Kafka esque. I got obsessed with it. I got obsessed with the term. I got obsessed with the author, and that's why I bought Franz Kafka's books first thing. And uh, I, I really, I'm really looking forward to read Franz Kafka. I think he's one author that can give me a reality check. You know. I have been wanting to read a lot of teenage books, a good teenage books, like you know, John Green. <laughs> Very good. Yeah. I, I mean. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't want to read dark shit. Yeah. This year, for some reason, just the you know the superficial, shallow love story. Yeah, I get it. Yeah. No judgments. Yeah. So, yeah, nothing. <laughs> no, you said no, no. <laughs> no, I would never. I. Uh, it's a very famous book, though. Many people have recommended this on Pinterest. On Pinterest. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the teenage pile that you see on Pinterest and yeah. very pretty pictures. All the bright places, yeah. All, yeah, all the bright places is what I want to read. All the bright places is something yeah. everybody should read. My next uh, book on my wish list is. Uh, <laughs> word. Yeah. It's a book I bought from uh, the book fair that happened in January. It's uh, Virginia Woolf's lecture, like a combination of lectures on feminism. Uh, I mean, not like really deep feminism the way we talk about, but you know, feminism is <laughs> pre modern and. Uh, she talks about how she just talks in the most realist way about feminism, not exaggerating it or not, you know, without any nare bazi, just you know, talking about it. And then we realize how deep it is. Okay, so the book's title is A Room of One's Own. And I am in love with that book ever since I bought it. So I hope I read that book this year. I wanna read Ruskin Wonder way too much. I've read like, Ruskin Ruskin Ruskin. I I haven't yet. And I not, love Ruskin Wonder. Not exactly. In school I've read his novels, yeah. but I love Ruskin Wonder. Yeah. Ruskin Wonder is the grandfather I would love to have. But he's not. <laughs> that's okay. Yeah. But, but, um there's this book called Maharani or something and I, I'm not very sure who wrote it. But that's also, also a book I want to read. Okay, I want to read. I actually started this book last year, but then I couldn't finish it. Like I read just the first chapter, first chapter. Yeah, Less Miserables by Victor Hugo. Mm -hmm. I think you all you all know about that book. I mean, even the movie came with Bradley Cooper. So I hope I finish that book this year. I really want to because I know it's uh, it's an amazing story, and I have a certain kind of obsession with Victor Hugo, which I won't go in detail because it's kind of personal and creepy. So yeah, I never finish that book. <laughs> Come again. <laughs> My uh, next in the wish list is Gabriel Marquez. Gabriel Garcia Marquez. Oh, I have read him. I love him. Yeah. In Love in the Time of Cholera and 100, 100 Years of Solitude uh, and uh, the 
Chronicle of Death, Foretold. Yeah. I mean, that guy got an Nobel Prize and he's an amazing storyteller. So he writes like Salman Rushdie, magical realism. Ah, that's that's what. Yeah, Gabriel Gabriel Garza Marquez is something everybody should read. But I might read him to the very end of the year because right now I want to read very light things. Yeah, I also want to read 1984 by George Orwell because not because the book has been recently been famous ever since Trump came. Mm-hmm. I actually wanted to read that book for too long, 1984. But I bought it like two years ago, and I still haven't read it. Shit, man. Yeah, George Orwell. Um, I also want to read uh, Eleanor and Park by Rainbow. Trust Rocket. me, this list can go forever and forever and forever. <laughs> I have more than hundred, one hundred books which I haven't read and are there in my bookshelf. And I hope nobody in my family sees this part of the video yeah. where I say that there are hundred, hundred books. So yeah, but this this these were our priorities. These were the first ones that came to our head when we thought about our 2017 wish list. So it is a wrap because somebody commented, "I look like Superwoman." Oh, that is a wrap. Then tell us about your wish list so that maybe they could become and, a part of our wish list as well. And give us some video ideas, guys. Please. <laughs> this one's struggling. Oh yeah, that's it. Subscribe. Tell us your wish list. Already. Yeah, like, like, and share. As much as you can, because we're so cool. Yeah, thanks. We love you. Bye. Read.